As the world knows, the Oprah Winfrey Show has come to an end after 25 years on the air. Tonight, the Emmys are honoring Oprah with the first ever Chairman's Crystal Pillar Award. I am proud to call Oprah my friend. And I join with many of Oprah's friends tonight to say, Oprah, you may be off the air for now, but you will never, ever, ever be out of our hearts. So we say to you, and I never thought I'd feel this way. And as far as I'm concerned, I'm glad I got the chance to say that I do believe I love you. And if I should ever go away, well then close your eyes and try to feel the way we do today. And then if you can remember, keep smiling, keep shining, knowing you can always count on me, for sure, that's what friends are for, in good times and bad times, I'll be on your side forevermore, mm -hmm. that's what friends are was such a nervous wreck. I had no idea what to do or what to say. And I thought in my head that maybe I'll just pretend that I'm Barbara. You could invite anybody you wanted in the world to come on your show and sit and talk to you. A whole world and myriad of people did. <laughs> what gets you excited? Is funny in your jeans? <laughs> I don't care about stars. What really matters is what's behind that facade. What I care about is the quality of life and energy exuded from the person uh -huh. who is called a star. We've never seen you behave this way before. I know. Have you ever felt this way? What's the real scoop? Why did you decide to end the show? This is Brad's first interview in front of an audience. Bring it on, baby. <laughs> well, we're gonna be drunk in a minute. <laughs> We're chocolate and vanilla. Va, 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 boom, It was just a friendly kiss. Uh, mm, uh, I'd like to see your checkbook. And everybody like to see yours. <laughs> what does bootylicious mean? Do you wish you'd never said anything about the virginity thing? I'm safe here. Oprah, it's only because it's you. I promised my mom I wasn't going to cry on Oprah. <laughs> Four years of the Chris Rock show, no Oprah Winfrey joke. I told my mother I'm doing Oprah first thing. You put a suit on and it was literally like my career hadn't done anything. And then like I was on Oprah Winfrey and people called, man, you done made it. I was scared to death if you knew I was gay that you wouldn't like me. I know you will give it your all. If you want to speak to America, speak to Oprah. Please welcome one of Oprah's favorite physicians, an Emmy winner tonight, Dr. Oz. 